Hello guys and welcome back to a new Disney Heroes Battle Mode video and in today's video I'm going to be going over the Maui Chip Bundle and now I've changed the name of this series I do to Cop or Not so the idea is am I going to cop the deal or am I not going to cop it basically it sounds better than is it worth it is it worth it? it sounds better it's got a better ring to it it's the exact same thing but I can finish every single video off by telling you whether to cop it or not. So I have to give a shout out to my friend Harry for giving me this idea because it sounds better. So we're going to start on quite a good deal actually this one, um, the Maui chip bundle. And now m normally all of these deals which cost diamonds I normally consider over the ones that cost money because you need to compare it to the odds of if you open that's three thousand so that's basically opening 10 diamond crates so that's four i think it's about 400 400 ish more diamonds than buying a diamond crate and now if you open a diamond crate there is no way no way at all that you'd ever get anywhere near a hundred shards for a character especially one of the newer ones and now I have complained about Maui quite a bit, but because I've got quite far in the game now and I've got to the stage of the game where it's just like, what else do I have to do? So I do my daily missions every day and now I'm just trying to level up all my characters. So I am 100% going to cop this and I will do it in a second. But the main reason I'm doing it is because Maui's in quite a lot of the friendship missions the very end game ones and you're going to need Maui upgraded to level up people like Moana um, friendships stitches friendships and all bits and bobs like that so yes I am going to cop this and I'm going to do it now because this is ridiculously worth it deal you get 100 shards for basically the crate of the cost of a diamond crate plus 400 diamonds so I'm going to buy it now Yes, look at that, bad boy. 100 of the Beauty Maui shards. Now, you might be thinking, good God, that is a lot of diamonds you've just spent. Yes, it is, but I've just explained to you my main reason why I copped this deal. And that is, once again, because it's basically the same price as the diamond, the 10 times diamond crates, a little bit more. But you're, gar you're guaranteed what you see. You open a diamond crate, you can get 10 blue badges and you've wasted 2,100. Now, I was going to wait and do the hero shard crate, but this is better still because, okay, you could argue that if you got the jackpot in the hero shard crate, uh, it would cost 1,700. But, you know, once again, I was guaranteed 100 shards for this character, which means I could easily get him up to four stars which I wouldn't have been able to do otherwise because all of his missions are in chapter 13 elite and I haven't even attempted that yet. So like I said, if we go to him now, I've got 165 and I can potentially start to get him to five stars going through missions. So where is it? There he is. So I can already get him to four stars, which isn't too bad. You can get him to four stars straight away. The next character I'm going to level up is Moana. I'm going to I am going to put about 4 mil into her. That will be in my next video. So make sure you stay tuned because I'll be doing a video of me unlocking and evolving Moana. But yeah, so I'm basically going to save my diamonds because once a month I treat myself to the £16 pack. So that will be when there's a somewhat decent deal. So like this month I brought the pack that had... Uh, it was £16, it was one of those really quick deals that disappeared within an hour and it gave me 150 shards for Stitch. 150, which is, to be fair with you, outrageous. Like, I can get them to four stars already. So I'm trying to get the majority of my characters to four stars because when they're four stars, they're, they're like ridiculously overpowered. Obviously, five stars is better but I'm going for more characters. I've got my main, you know, six, six-ish characters all to five stars apart from Woody. But the reason I'm trying to get everyone to four stars is because four stars are a really good level to have everybody on. It seems to allow you to get through so many friendship missions. So I've got Stitch to do, I've got Mar Miranda to do, I've got Mari to do. Um, I've got a few characters I can just mess around with getting them up to four stars and stuff. 
So thank you for watching this video of my first episode of Cop or Not. I copped this deal and so should you. Guys, make sure you go into my description and follow me on all the social media links below, especially my Instagram and my Facebook page. That's where I'm most active. You'll see uh, unique gaming clips and photos and behind the scenes stuff, especially on my Instagram. And my next competition will be run on Instagram. So make sure you check that out. Come and join my Discord and you're about to chat to me in a community of Disney Heroes players and just gamers in general. And if you feel like supporting me, which would mean the world to me, check out my Patreon, even a dollar, even a pound, even one yen, whatever your currency is, it's all helpful. I'll see you guys in the next video. Subscribe to join the Giraffe Gang.